emerged. And I make no claims that the method I will describe is the last word in benzodiazepine withdrawal, but it is based on close experience with these very articulate patients who attended my clinic, and it's later been confirmed by many, many hundreds more uh, with whom I've been in contact since the clinic closed. And the th basic principles for benzodiazepine withdrawal are very, very simple. Uh, they simply consist of gradual dosage reduction and psychological support if needed. It's generally agreed that dosage should be tapered gradually. Abrupt withdrawal, especially from high doses, can precipitate convulsions, psychosis, and panic reactions. And the rate of tapering should be individually tailored to the patient's personal needs, taking into account lifestyle, personality, environmental stresses, reasons for taking the benzodiazepines, the duration and dose of drug use, the amount of support available, and many other personal factors. There can't be a single protocol that applies to everybody because everybody is different. And the whole process may take weeks, months, or even a, a year or more. It seems to me there's no need to hurry in patients who've been taking benzodiazepines for years anyway. Coping without drugs is essentially a learning process which can take a long time. And in my experience, the best results are achieved if the patient himself, and not the doctor, is in control of the rate of withdrawal, and he can uh, proceed at whatever rate he or she finds tolerable. Most patients are quite capable of controlling their own withdrawal, given suitable advice and encouragement. The doctor and patient together can initially devise a mutually agreed withdrawal schedule, but this may require readjustments from time to time depending on progress. And if problems arise, um, the dosage can be stabilized for a few weeks or the rate of withdrawal decreased. But it is important always to go forward and to avoid a backward step of increasing the dosage again. For most patients on therapeutic doses of benzodiazepines, uh, withdrawal is best carried out as an outpatient. Rapid detoxification in detox units uh, is utterly inappropriate because it's too fast and the patient has no time to build up alternative living skills in their own environment, a process which may take many months. And patients who become involuntarily dependent through doctor's prescriptions often find it traumatic to be treated in the same unit as illicit drug and alcohol use abusers. 